First of all, our team would like to thank Chitkara University, Nugen IEDC for the prototype funding for fabrication and testing of hypoxia flask for in vitro use. We have proposed hypoxia flask for better regulation of hypoxic condition for in vitro studies. There exists no such device for direct hypoxia treatment to cells as per the requirement of experiments. There are existing device that is hypoxia chamber which lack reproducibility in long duration of experiment and these chambers are very bulky, large in size and expensive as well. Hence a device which can overcome these challenges is required for planning hypoxia experiments by researchers at all level. So we have proposed a compact, handy and significantly cheap hypoxia flask which can be an alternate to hypoxia chamber. The design flask has a knob to control hypoxic air and an outlet or inlet port attached to oxygen cylinder for maintaining regular and uninterrupted hypoxia. The device will be easy to use with continuous flow of hypoxic air to maintain reproducibility in multiple experiment. We can use separate flask simultaneously at different time points without disturbing other treatments. This setup will be far more cheaper than the existing options. These are the different perspective views of our proposed design of the prototype of hypoxia flask. Coming to the methodology, different steps for implementation of actions are fabrication, sterilization and testing of hypoxia condition in the proposed flask. For fabrication, we will be implementing 3D printing technology for making one inlet port, one outlet port and a base for attachment on each flask. Sterilization of flask will be carried out by using gamma irradiation and UV and the important achievable points for sterilization are uh, like to maintain sterile condition for growing cells and ensure consistent supply of hypoxic air. Further, it will be easy for imaging and harvesting cells in between experiments. For testing knobs attached to the flask, uh, we will be tested for leakage and durability for long time usage. Cellular protein expression will be tested in hypoxic condition by using western blotting technique. This will ensure that our device is maintaining hypoxia independently. Uh, as there is no device exist in hypoxia research, so there is huge scope that our prototype fits smoothly in market with help of prior testing and validation. A design patent of hypoxia flask has been granted and an utility patent has also been published. This is our team, myself Pooja Kumari, Junior Research Fellow and Monica Sharma, Research Assistant. The project is mentored by Dr. Satyam Kumar Agarwal, Professor at Center for In Vitro Studies and Translational Research, Kyurin Chitkara University, Punjab. Thank you.